DC fans, this is Max Prime, back again, doing my Flash review, that's right, DC TV Flash. Uh, if you like this video, hit the subscribe button on the link below. The Flash episode, season 4, episode 17, Null and Annoyed. Uh, we know the season has been going in the pace of the, the thinker wants to capture all the metahumans, take all of their abilities, and also ruin the Flash's life. Teasers from season 3 involving Savitar in regards to the, de the device that is going to be created to defeat the thinker. Um, Barry actually had that hint way back when. So this episode was very interesting because, yes, it, it got involved with the uh, metahuman named Null. Uh, we had Cisco being approached by Breacher from Earth-19. You know, Breacher wanted Cisco to actually replace him as he was losing his powers. And then the reason why I'm doing this review, because uh, this review is in regards to the end of the episode. Now, if you haven't seen the episode, definitely watch it and you'll know what I'm actually talking about. But the ending, and we're going to actually watch it here in a little bit, um, the end shows Harrison Wells. That's right, Harry, remember, he's been working on this, uh, working on the helmet, you know, that helps him think, you know, like a thousand times smarter than the thinker. And we see him actually access Eobard Thawne's room within Star Labs. He hooks up the helmet to these wires, and then when he goes and he activates Gideon, and Gideon says the the, the bomb of the episode, that's right, the, the, the egg drop, whatever you want to call it, the Easter egg, he said, or she says that, uh, welcome back, you know, her welcome back, you know, Mr. Wells or Dr. Wells. It's been 1,078 days since we last spoke. And he's like, yeah, well, things have changed. Wow. So that moment there just blew my mind. And I'm like, wait a minute. What Harrison Wells, if, 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 like, first of all, is this Eobard Thawne or is this Harry, you know, who's just pretending to be him when he was talking to Gideon? Okay, let's talk some possibilities. Number one, if this is Eobard Thawne, is this Eobard from, let's say, the crossover, you know, in regards to the Nazi Earth X, you know, the crisis on Earth X or Earth 10? Was this, is, is this the Eobard that escaped Barry's clutches during the end of that crossover? Or is this the actual real Eobard Thawne from Earth 1, Star, you know, uh, Star Labs Eobard? Uh, because 10, 1,078 days actually equals, I guess somebody calculated online the amount of time from one of the season 1 episodes called Trapped, where basically Eobard and, and, and Reverse Flash, or Reverse Flash was actually captured by the Star Labs team. What, what are your thoughts on that? Um, my thoughts are like, it could either be Eobard again, and maybe he's just tricked everyone to believe that maybe he was from Earth 2, but really it was real, really Eobard, or is this really Harry pretending to be e Eobard Thon? This is a completely mind-blowing revelation, and again, the, the Flash season, if you haven't you noticed, it's been kind of slow with the Thinker, with him capturing every single metahuman, collecting their abilities one by one. The Flash was kind of getting like, eh, a little bit stale, and then this happens. Eobard Thawne, the return possibly, this, this, now this has got, you know, me back interested again in The Flash now, you know, Black Lightning has been good, uh, Legends of Tomorrow has been good, and then this happens, and it's like, whoa, now this is totally interesting, because, yeah, if Barry happens to defeat the Thinker, then what happens after that? Then he has to deal with Eobard again? What are your thoughts? Leave your comments on the video below. That was my quick, like, you could say, reaction review to that episode because the ending was phenomenal. About damn time, you know, because we always see Harrison Wells, you know, Tom Cavanaugh play that character, and he's been kind of reserved through this whole entire season, you know, he's been bumbling around, stumbling, not being able to figure out the thinking cap, you know, he's not been able to help the group, and then this happens. Holy sh**, it might be Eobard Thawne. What are your thoughts? Again, like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know what you thought of the episode. Um, I'm Max Prime, and I'm out.